Unveiling the Mystique, Understanding Ancestral Spirits. Hello and welcome to our language learning journey. Today, we're diving into a fascinating and culturally rich topic, ancestral spirits. This phrase is not just a linguistic term, but a gateway to understanding diverse beliefs and traditions around the world. Whether you're a language enthusiast or a cultural explorer, this video is designed to enhance your understanding and usage of this intriguing concept in English. The term, ancestral spirits, refers to the spirits or souls of deceased ancestors. These are often regarded as protectors, guides, or sources of wisdom in various cultures. The idea is that even after death, our ancestors continue to have an influence on our lives. It's a concept found in many societies globally, transcending geographical and cultural boundaries. Understanding this term also opens a window into how different cultures view life, death, and the afterlife. Ancestral spirits are not just a part of folklore. They hold significant cultural and spiritual importance. In many traditions, ancestors are revered and honored through rituals, ceremonies, and festivals. This reverence reflects the belief that ancestral spirits can provide guidance, blessings, or even protection to the living. For instance, in some Asian cultures, there are annual ceremonies specifically dedicated to honoring the ancestors, showcasing the deep respect for this concept. The phrase, ancestral spirits, is also prevalent in language and literature. It's used to convey a sense of heritage and continuity. Writers often use this term to add depth to their narratives, connecting characters to their roots and heritage. In everyday language, it might be used metaphorically to express a deep connection with one's past or heritage. In learning English, understanding phrases like ancestral spirits enriches your vocabulary especially when exploring literature, history, or cultural studies. It's also a great conversation starter for discussing beliefs and traditions. When you come across this phrase, think about the context. Is it literal, metaphorical, or symbolic? This understanding can add nuance to your comprehension and usage of English. I hope this exploration of ancestral spirits has been enlightening. Remember, language learning is not just about words, but also about understanding the culture and ideas behind them. So, the next time you encounter the term, ancestral spirits, you'll appreciate not just its meaning, but its cultural depth as well. Thanks for watching, and happy learning!